One of the rules for polynomial transforms is that k times f of x will give us g of x, where k is just an integer. So if we're given this function, uh, we want to know what k is. So if the form is an integer times a function gives us the new function, and this is the new function, then there must have been another function that had been multiplied by an integer to give us this. So essentially what we want to look for is something that we can factor out of this so that we would have an integer times some polynomial. If we look at the coefficients, we have 3, negative 27, and 9. There is a common factor of 3 in each of these, and that is the greatest common factor in each of these terms within our polynomial, so we will factor a 3 out of this. When we factor 3 out, we see that we have 3 times a polynomial. This polynomial in parentheses is our f of x. The 3 is going to be our k, so we have solved this. k equals 3, and f of x equals x squared minus 9x plus 3. And we weren't necessarily asked for f of x up here, but it is a byproduct of solving for k, so I've gone ahead and written that down, and so we have figured out how this function was transformed into this function by multiplying by this integer.